here we are going to discuss the question what do you mean by fully developed flow when the flow of fluid takes place through a pipe the velocity profile changes continuously as we can see in the diagram the initially velocity profile is rectangular which shows the constant velocity of every particle entering the pipe I, however this uh, velocity profile changes uh, to or deform to some another shape over a distance of the pipe called as entrance length in entrance length at every section the velocity profile changes continuously and when the fluid particle passes the uh, this entrance length distance the velocity profile does not change it becomes the constant or we can say it becomes fully developed after the entrance length flow is as per the constant velocity profile and this flow is called as fully developed flow so we can say we can summarize our as a fully developed flow as a uh, flow with constant um, velocity profile which occurs after the entrance length depending upon the reynolds number the f uh, fully developed flow may be laminar or turbulent now what is the importance of fully developed flow so actually uh, most of the formulas we, we we have used or studied in undergraduate study are uh, related to only for fully developed flow